With its iconic white rhinos teetering on the verge of extinction, Kenya is planning to use IVF in a bid to increase population numbers. The country is home to the only two remaining females on the planet. The Kenya Wildlife Service is teaming up with Biorescue Consortium to save this species, as this expert explains. The Biorescue Consortium has developed quite as uh, advanced uh, technologies uh, in terms of uh, reproduction. And outside there in Europe, they are doing what we're calling the stem cell. Uh, uh, we have the stem cell assisted, uh, assisted te uh, technologies. And also now in country, we are trying to use the assistant reproductive technologies uh, where we are doing the in vitro, in vitro fertilization, uh, which uh, try to go hand in hand in the efforts to try and bring these species back uh, to life. The country plays an important role in supervising the health of the two rhinos for the IVF process. For experts, helping to increase population numbers of the white rhino could protect other endangered species. Uh, if you get eventually to be able to get um, northern white rhinos being born uh, from these uh, kind of techniques, uh, either through the in vitro fertilization and also the embryo transfers, so if you get the offsprings, it will go a long way in uh, showing us that we can be able to save uh, different species in the world, not only in Kenya. Uh, but uh, the success in this uh, will tell us that we are able uh, not, uh, to look even into the future of other species that may be facing a similar kind of threat. Rhinos have a life expectancy of up to 40 years in the wild. With the two females aged 34 and 24, Time is running out to prevent their extinction.